Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Kujan with the Adult Faith Formation Team. We hope you all are getting excited for Holy Week. This past week, we looked at the gospel of the woman caught in adultery. And in this gospel, we see Jesus masterfully dealing with a terrible situation. And he invites us to walk with him that we too can make a positive difference. There's the woman who is perhaps justly, perhaps unjustly convicted of a crime. But although the law says to do something with her, Jesus looks into her and sees someone who is willing to be changed. And so Jesus acts mercifully towards this woman and at the same time invites those who want to condemn her to look at themselves first. To judge another person without looking at yourself is very wrong. Jesus looks to the heart of the person, not simply the actions they do. So in our journey through Lent, as we work on our own spiritual lives, work on our relationships, using prayer time to reflect on how God can renew us. We need to also pray for those in our lives who we might be upset by or we really struggle to deal with for various reasons. Because when God forgives you and forgives others, God is more present than if you are simply dismissal of others for their faults or um, constantly judging. And I think it's, it's a good thing to pray with this text of our gospel because the more we forgive and the more we invite others to healing rather than judgmentally condemn others, the more we can be like Jesus. And this Lent, we've been trying to be good disciples of Jesus and to, to grow. It's important at times to reflect on what we've done wrong to attend the Sacrament of Reconciliation, to make a daily examination of conscience, to see what's wrong in our own lives that needs healing. And that way we'll be better equipped to help others who are struggling. So we hope you all have a wonderful Holy Week coming up and God bless you.